see uh, the last team I was working in, in Bangkok, we had 15 uh, technical team members. Uh, 15 technical team members where each and everybody was absolutely from the physical athletic side to the analytic side taking over individual responsibilities uh, and this is a normal way in these days uh, and from this point uh, it's very important for me and very important for the club uh, to, to have an, uh, a technical team member I basically hate the word of assistance uh, it has to be a coach uh, if you can get somebody from the pedigree, from the knowledge, from the development, uh, let's say Fadlu David, uh, it would have been a fantastic uh, uh, situation. But respecting the situation where he is in with Maritzburg United, that makes no sense uh, to, to destroy uh, a certain direction. I think there are other people uh, well known with a good uh, character and with good knowledge uh, who can contribute and this is what we are doing. And this is in these days not only uh, to to go into one person. You, you you have to manage. You have to handle it. You have to direct it in your entire technical team. Uh, if a goalkeeper is is not really connected, is not really uh, playing this game uh, in ball position or not in ball position, there are two different areas. Uh, and if it doesn't work, it's not performing. Uh, of course, you 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 must make sure as goalkeeper coach, what's, what's wrong, what's happening, that's a responsibility, a very clear, did we select the wrong goalkeeper, must we strengthen it, and the same, if, if a team is, is not uh, capable of uh, moving 90 minutes, <laughs> it's a very clear understanding, and everybody inside a brand or inside a club in these days, before the coach was asked, in this, they spend a lot of money for GPS, uh, for knowledgeable uh, people in terms of physical trainer, in terms of preventive, uh, you see the high performance center, and, and that tells you the story. It is it's not a one-man show anymore, not at all.